I'm Danielle Michaud enjoying an absolutely picture perfect day at Lionhead Golf Club where they're hosting the seventh annual tee off for melanoma golf tournament. The nicer it gets, the more people want to be outside and be active, but the more you got to think about sun safety as melanoma is the fastest growing cancer worldwide. People are always saying, what, what is the best sunscreen for me to use? And I say, it's the one you wear. Time to change the trajectory, and I think, or the pathway of this disease. One of the concerning things is that the rates of melanoma and skin cancers have tripled in the country in the last 30 years. So we're doing something wrong. Our message is that we we can prevent this disease in many cases, not in all cases, but the majority of melanomas and skin cancers can be prevented. And prevention's never been easier. A medix technology can scan any worrisome areas, send it to a dermatologist, and get results within 72 hours. This assessment likely saved Bill McElroy's life. When I was young I worked in construction and there was no sunscreen and uh, we had a boat up north and there was no sunscreen there either so obviously the damage has been done and now it's starting to show. I uh, had Mike scan me and uh, within a couple days I had the uh, mole removed. It was uh, precancerous, but it's good to get it out, right? In um, Norway, we have 104 uh, locations in Boots pharmacies. We've done over 77,000 scans where people have walked into a Boots pharmacy and scan. We've caught 862 melanomas, over 2,400 non-melanoma skin cancers, but 862 people are alive today because of this technology. Paul Sinto knows the importance of covering up. He's a survivor of stage 3 melanoma and urges others to take this seriously. It's been a really good success story for myself uh, and uh, also for you know all the, the support uh, staff at Princess Margaret and the treatment plan that I've been on. So I can't say enough good things about it. Please, please uh, take it seriously uh, for yourselves, for your kids, and, and anyone around you, to be honest. Head to melanomanetwork.ca to see a list of the locations where you can get a scan. There's over 145 spots across the country.